The Vatican now acknowledges that Catholicism has an existential crisis. It's described this sexual abuse meeting as an attempt to restore the very credibility of the church. Opening the unprecedented event on Thursday, Pope Francis said action was necessary. Facing the plague of sexual abuse by the church's men against minors, I have thought to consult you, because all together we should hear the Holy Spirit and listen to the cry of the young who want justice. The weight of pastoral and ecclesiastic responsibility which forces us to discuss this together is a burden on our meeting about how to face this evil which afflicts the church and the whole of humanity. The holy people of God are watching us and wait not just for simple and expected conviction but concrete and effective measures. Senior clergy have been summoned to the Vatican from all over the world. Francis wants bishops and cardinals to understand that sexual abuse by priests is a scandal that they all have a responsibility to stop. For a lot of years, the first problem was to cover up, to avoid a scandal of the good name of the church. Now, thanks God, is not going to happen and uh, something is changed absolutely. But is a process that uh, needs time. And, and I told but him, victims of abuse, like, like Canadian Leona Huggins, who was abused by a priest from the age of 12, aren't reassured by what they've heard from the meeting so far. As survivors were on the outside, I'm concerned some of the things that I'm hearing coming out. The Bishop of Milan said this morning that we're looking for mercy for both the survivor and the perpetrator. This focus should be on the survivors only, on the crime of clergy abuse. They may be on the outside, but survivor groups like Ending Clergy Abuse are still trying to keep up the pressure, hoping that their message is getting through. The phrase they keep using here is zero tolerance. They want sex abusing clergy to be thrown out of the priesthood. The same for those who covered up that abuse. And if this four day meeting at the Vatican does not produce that, then the people here won't be satisfied that the Catholic Church is really facing up to its responsibility to protect children. Rory Challenge, Al Jazeera, Rome.